This video arrived at the perfect moment for you as if orchestrated by the universe. Continue viewing once you start to see the world in a multidimensional way, you'll notice a transformation in your perception of reality. Often we limit ourselves with self-created barriers. Reality extends beyond mere physical interaction to the emotions and interpretations we associate with those emotions. It's a rich, tapestry of feelings and longings mirroring our deepest selves. This fundamental drive propels us forward, its achievement intertwined with how clearly and genuinely we pursue it. Without this drive, we're akin to a flame starved of air, yet when our desires are pure, untainted by ego or materialistic goals, they can be our guiding light. Toward true understanding, engaging in meditation opens a gateway to a broader self-awareness in this expanded state. Many have transcended their narrow view of existence. Meditation unveils that we are more than our physical form. We're souls residing in a body. Consciousness unbounded by the constraints of time and space, some have even glimpsed future events in our three-dimensional realm. This foresight suggests that life on Earth follows a preordained path existing in another dimension, and trickling into ours events seen before their occurrence in our world imply they're predestined from a three-dimensional perspective. Can we alter our future, absolutely shaping destiny through perception? Any change we make, realigns our path forging a new direction from that point. Onward, our destiny's beauty lies in its flexibility shaped more by our beliefs and emotions than our actions. We are fundamentally a reflection of our self-perception. Viewing ourselves in a new light changes our actions, which in turn reshapes our self-image and redirects our future. Every change begins with a shift in our consciousness. The future, despite being intricately planned, holds endless possibilities. Each decision presents a junction, offering multiple potential futures we possess, dual perspectives of the world, one physical and the other spiritual. These can be seen as the worldly mind and the divine mind. The worldly mind is our everyday consciousness, driven by senses and desires, this perspective struggles to grasp spiritual truths, seeing reality as the immediate present, while the past and future are mere concepts in contrast. The spiritual view encompasses all time making the past and future as palpable as the physical world. For the spiritual individual, what is abstract and subjective for the worldly person becomes concrete and real. Our vision is often limited by an over-reliance on the physical senses leaving us oblivious to the unseen, to perceive the invisible we need to shift our focus from the tangible to the intangible embracing and visualizing it until it becomes as real as the world we touch. Deep-focused contemplation can help us tune out distractions and fully engage with the desired reality. This act of shifting our attention from the sensory to the unseen sharpens our spiritual perception, allowing us to perceive beyond the physical realm. Since the beginning, the unseen has been perceptible to those who earnestly seek it. This ability to see is not tied to our physical senses. Nurturing and valuing this skill is essential, as it is through this elevated vision, that we can discern spiritual truths to truly harness the power of our consciousness. We must learn to balance these two perspectives in doing so. We can navigate the complexities of life with a deeper understanding and heightened awareness as we cultivate. This balance, we begin to see the interplay between the physical and the spiritual, realizing that each decision shapes not only our immediate reality, but also our spiritual journey. This realization empowers us to make choices that align with our higher purpose leading us toward a path of growth and enlightenment. By practicing regularly, we uncover cover and incredible power. It's all about guiding our imagination to shape our future. The way we want it. Our actions are powered by desire. Without it. We wouldn't even bother to move our hearts are driven by our strongest desires. Overcoming a habit means our wish to break it is greater than the urge to keep it. The desires that guide us are what grab our attention. Visualizing your dreams. You can't think of a better way to make our dreams come true than to picture in our minds what it would feel like to already achieve them. This act of imagination lays out the path to make it happen. 
Our inner self, with its far-reaching vision, finds ways to bring our wishes to life. It might be hard for a mind not used to this to believe in something it can't see, but there's a trick to making things happen before they actually do, to treat the unseen as if it were real, the power of keeping. Things simple is often overlooked, but this straightforward method to shape the future has been found through years of study and trial. The first thing to do when you want to change your future is to know exactly what you want. Then think of a scene that shows your wish coming true with you, right in the middle of it. The next step is to relax, almost like you're about to sleep. Sit back, close your eyes, and focus on the scene you want to happen. Imagine yourself right in the middle of it, not just watching but being part of it. This should feel as real as your everyday life for this imagined scene to come true. It's vital to keep in mind that what you're picturing should directly follow your wish coming true. Dive into this scene until it feels as real as anything else. The more we practice this, the more natural it becomes to us. Gradually, our minds start to accept these imagined realities as possible. Even likely, this shift in belief is powerful. It starts to pull opportunities and circumstances toward us, aligning with our desires. It's like we're sending out a signal to the universe, telling it exactly what we want. And the universe begins to respond, like how we signal the universe to reach the 100k subscribers mark, and the universe helps us gradually reach it. You can also help us by hitting the red button. Thanks in this process. Patience plays a crucial role. Change doesn't always happen overnight. We must trust in the power of our imagination, and the process doubts and impatience can cloud our vision delaying or even derailing our dreams. It's essential to maintain a clear, focused mind and be confident in the outcome as we become more adept. At this, we might start to notice subtle changes in our environment and in ourselves. These changes are signs that our desires are beginning to manifest. It could be a chance meeting an unexpected opportunity or a sudden surge of inspiration. These are not coincidences. They are the fruits of our imaginative labor, harnessing imagination's power. The power of our imagination is limitless. It transcends the boundaries of time and space, allowing us to create and experience realities beyond the immediate physical world. By harnessing this power, we open doors to infinite possibilities. Our desires, once just fleeting thoughts, begin to take shape in the world around us, proving that what we envision with conviction can indeed become our reality. For instance, suppose you aspire to a job promotion. Envision a scenario where you're being congratulated for this achievement. Once you've pinpointed this particular moment, ease your body into a relaxed yet conscious state, akin to the edge of sleep, while maintaining control over your thoughts in this serene yet aware state. Picture a colleague facing you reach out in your mind to shake their hand and feel the solidity of the handshake. Imagine having a conversation that reflects this new accomplishment. Instead of viewing yourself as an outsider, as if you were watching a movie, immerse yourself fully in the experience. Feel the reality of the moment, as if it's happening right now, rather than just spectating this deep involvement in the present moment, as though it's unfolding in real time is what truly matters. Bringing a distant place closer and the future into the present means making a higher, dimensional world part of our every everyday life. This blending of space and time is crucial. The difference between actively participating in an action and merely observing yourself do it can be the difference between success and failure. These conditions also help to protect our spiritual self when our body is still, our minds open up to the idea of action. We can imagine doing something right here and now and hold on to that image until we fall asleep. It's possible to wake up in a larger world feeling everything more intensely living out what we've imagined, whether we wake up in that world or not. We are doing these actions in a higher dimensional world, and eventually they will happen in our everyday world. We've learned it's important to pick one specific action focus on it and repeat it in our minds until it feels real. Otherwise, we might get distracted by different images and thoughts losing sight of our goal. If climbing a specific part of a staircase represents our goal, we need to focus just on that. 
if we get sidetracked, we must come back to climbing that specific part until it feels as real as the world around us. This visualization should be easy, filled with the sense of achieving our desires being a bit sleepy, helps, as it makes focusing easier. But we shouldn't fall asleep completely and lose control of our thoughts. The best state is a light relaxation, where we're still in charge of our minds. A great way to make a wish come true is to feel it's already done. Then, in a relaxed state, repeat short phrases symbolizing our wishes' fulfillment like a mantra, a simple thank you. Works imagining we're thanking for our wish, already being, Granted, but if we want a conscious experience in a bigger world, we should stick to our imaginative actions until we fall asleep. Imagine as real as life. How you would feel if your wish came true. Eventually you will feel it in the real world, just as you did in your mind. Feed your mind with beliefs and statements. You see as true, even if they don't seem real. If you stick with them until they feel real, they will become true in your life. Once you believe in something, do everything to make it happen. Conclusion as a whole, imagination is not just a private revelry. It is a transformative force. It has the power to reshape our world, breaking the shackles of the mundane and opening the gates to unexplored realms. This force fuels innovation and progress, turning dreams into tangible realities. Remember every great invention, every ah, uh, Monumental change began as a simple thought, a spark of imagination in someone's mind. So cherish your imaginative power for it is the architect of change and the harbinger of a brighter future. As you navigate through life, let your imagination be your compass, guiding you through uncharted territories with faith and hope. As your steadfast companions, by nurturing your imagination, you not only enrich, your personal experiences, but also contribute to the collective tapestry of human creativity and potential embrace it and let it be the light that illuminates your path and the world around you. Enjoyed the video, share it, and leave your comments below.